In 1895, the London and South Western Railway took up a new locomotive engineer, Dougal Drummond. Four years later, Drummond would introduce his most famous design, the T9. This was a 52 ton 440 express locomotive with six foot seven inch driving wheels and a top speed exceeding 80 miles an hour. Small wonder really that these engines quickly became known as Greyhounds. By 1901, 66 T9s were in service, with nearly half of them being built by Dubs in Glasgow. The original engine looked a lot different to this, mostly because the smoke box was much smaller. This bigger variation was fitted in 1912 by Robert Urey, when the class were fitted with superheaters, maintaining their already great performance. The T9s maintained a good reputation throughout their lives, not just because of high speed, but due to the fact they were lightweight with a shorter wheelbase than any of Maunsell's moguls. This would help them in later years when surviving veterans were reallocated to work the North Devon and Cornwall lines around Oakhampton and Wadebridge. By 1959 there were still 20 T9s on BR's books, but two years later they had all been withdrawn. This one, number 120, became National Collection property in preservation, and ever since, she's been a rail enthusiast's icon. It's hard to explain her fame, since she wasn't a technological revolution or achieved any speed records, but there's something about her that nearly everyone seems to like. Nearly. Nearly.